Hello, dear ones. It's Alice. I have a blessing uh, for the Earth and, and to do with planet Maldek that I'm about to I'm about, about to t say and that you may wish to repeat and uh, confirm yourselves. Um, spirit to team. Scan, transform, and reprogram all malevolent malware and semi sentient or sentient life forms on planet Maldek or deport them to the appropriate location. Uh, scan, transform, reprogram. All malware on rocks, um, on meteorites, in our solar system, anywhere in our solar system. Scan, transform, and reprogram all malware in the human body, especially malevolent life forms in the form of microbes and etheric and astral malware in any of our human bodies for the all through free will. Blessings to Maldek. Um, one other thing regarding Maldek and the asteroid belt um, is such karma there. So I ask, uh, Spiritual Team, I ask that the timelines of the planet Maldek be optimized and the dimensional awareness the, okay the dimension there be optimized for the all through free will I ask for forgiveness from from our son for what has transpired on planet Maldek and I request that the karmic cards of planet Maldek be shuffled through and optimized for the all and for free will the malware that's out there right now that increases the urge to, for sexual activity, the malware that we've been dealing with for the last um, few years, it has to do with the spreads of the AIDS virus. And the AIDS virus is a form of um, uh, robotic knowledge from the planet Maldek. Uh, just as an aside, you know, sometimes these, these very out there theories and uh, ideas about how the universe is and, and how we're under threat and so forth, like the idea that microbes are being, like, imp that are some sort of alien, like, be of course they are, you know, inimical to humans sometimes. Some microbes are good and some are not. Uh, but as far as I know, or have known, they're all they're all earthbound and yet there is like in circulating in the newosphere right now this theory about microbes and alien species and so forth and sometimes these stories come from popular entertainment movies and so forth so whether or not they have um, uh, a basis in in the in the physical world as soon as they become established in our newosphere our um, unconscious thought cloud of the world and conscious thought cloud through popular media they need to be neutralized they need to be blessed and uplifted and transformed so so don't so feel free no matter what um, what far out story you run into in the newosphere feel free to bless transform and uplift it through the incoming, through the new light, and with the help of your celestial um, ascension team. I hope I make myself clear that first, the reason for this is that first, um, first reality begins to be established in the astral plane through the thought and feeling world, okay? And that is where it's most easy to stop it. Okay, stop it at that point rather than allowing it to actually filter into and, and become the popular reality. Instead, 
for the for the popular the true reality of 3d let us all think of the very highest possible good for planet earth and for the all okay so that's that's it for now